Thanks to the incredible popularity of Extraordinary Attorney Wu on Netflix, people all over the world have been introduced to Kang Tae-yo and have been captivated with him. It wasn't just the beloved lawyer Wu Young-woo, played by Park Yun bin he won over with his portrayal of the gentle and kind Lee Jun-ho, but also us K-drama fans. The first season of the show just ended, but Tao already has a long list of titles we can watch. Have a look at them through this list. Extraordinary Attorney Boo 2022 After acting in the drama Extraordinary Attorney Boo, Kang Tao's name may have just exploded. And this is the most recent example of this. The actor portrays the role of Lee Jun Ho, a well-liked employee at the Han Bada legal office who is well known for being kind to everyone. This drama follows his portrayal of this character. Additionally, he pays a great deal of attention to Wu Young Wu, played by Park Yun Bin, his colleague who was the first autistic spectrum lawyer to practice in Korea. Kang Tae-yo's fame increased as a result of the accomplishments of the role of extraordinary attorney Wu, which led to his becoming the first Korean male actor to be offered a fan meeting tour in Europe. Doom at Your Service 2021 The life of Tak Dong Kyung, played by Park Bo Young, comes to a screeching halt when she receives news that she has a terminal disease, is reprimanded at her job, and finds out that her partner has been cheating on her all in the same day. She makes a wish on a falling star for the end of the world when she is getting drunk and trying to forget her problems. Mule Mang, Sho In Kuk, a messenger between gods and humans, overhears her wish and despite her anxiety, he agrees to give it. Throughout the course of the series, Dong Kyung is shown going to a coffee shop that is run by Tao's character, Lee Hyun Kyung. Run On 2021 Former track and field star Ki Shun Chom, the character of MC Kwan, is forced to put his sports aspirations on hold. Ami Ju, personified by Shin Se Kyung, a hardworking dreamer who translates films and creates subtitles, is someone he meets and falls in love with. Sho Dan Ah, Choi Soo Young in real life, and Lee Hyung Hwa, given life by Tae Young, are good friends of theirs, and they are also exploring the possibility of romantic attraction. The Tale of Nokdu, 2019. Kang Tae-yo's starring role in the critically acclaimed drama The Tale of Nok Do allowed him to further develop his acting skills. Kang Tae-yo played the part of Cha Yul Mu, a gorgeous man with a special skill in cooking. In the drama that aired in 2019, alongside Jang Dong Hyun and Kim So Hyun. In this role, Kang Tae-yo appeared alongside the two actresses. A guy in the Joshun dynasty named John Nok Do, played by Jung Dong Yoon, falls in love with a girl named Dong Dong Ju, played by Kim So Hyun, during the course of this romantic comedy drama that was adapted from a webtoon. It is interesting to note that Kang Tae-yo received the 2019 KBS Drama Awards for his performance as a competent actor in the drama The Tale of Nok Do, which earned him the prize for Best New Actor. That Man Oh Soo 2018. Ah Soo, played by Lee Jong Hyun, is a knowledgeable IT professional who, against his will, manages a cafe that his family owns. His ancestors are the keepers of a mystical tree, and the pollen from that tree has the power to make two people fall in love with one another. One day, he has his own experience with matchmaking when he meets Sho Yu Ri, played by Kim Soo Hyun, who has recently ended a relationship and he begins to develop love for her. Tao portrays the role of Kim Jin Woo, a high school physical education teacher and Yu Ri's childhood buddy in this series. Short 2018 a young man from a rural location named Kang Ho Hyung, played by Tao, discovers his calling in the sport of speed skating. One day, he crosses paths with Park Yun Ho, also known as Yo Ho Yoon and known as the king of short track speed skating. Park Yun Ho is a legacy child who has been recruited to play for a big institution's team. The two adversaries are engaged in a contest for the love of the same female both on and off the ice. You Are Too Much 2017 You Are Too Much starring Kang Tae-yo was a drama that was released in 2017. In this drama, Kang Tae-yo is pitted against other top-tier actresses like Gu Hye-soon and Am Jung-hwa for the lead role. 
In the film You Were Too Much, Kang Tae-yo gives a performance as a young guy who, like his mother, Om Jung Hwa, is talented at playing the piano and singing. This drama follows the narrative of Yu Ji Na, who has been a popular singer for 20 years and competes against Jung Hae Dong, a woman who works as a copycat of Yu Ji Na in order to support her family finances after her father loses her job. Yu Ji Na is portrayed by Am Jung Hwa. Flower of the Queen 2015 Flower of the Queen is another weekend drama that spans 50 episodes. The story follows the ambitious woman Lee Soo Jung, played by Kim Sung Ryung, who, in the course of the drama, finds and reconciles with her daughter Kang Yi Sol, played by Lee Sung Kyung, whom she had previously abandoned. Dong Gu, the character that Kang Tae plays, is a polite and lovely young guy who has a crush for Yi Sol. When one considers the parts that Kang Tae has played in previous productions over the past 10 years, they typically involve him playing the part of a good natured guy who yearns for the love of people. Flower of the Queen is an excellent choice for viewers who are interested in getting a better look at the lovely actor when he was in his early to mid 20s, despite the fact that he doesn't have a significant role in the drama. Forever Young 2014 2016 Thuy Lin, sometimes known as Na Phuong, is a bright young woman from Vietnam who is completely enamored with the culture of South Korea. She is awarded a scholarship to attend a renowned institution in Korea and makes the journey there, where she meets Lee Jun Su, played by Tao, the son of the man who runs the dorm where she and her friends live. The fact that Jun Su is an idol trainee at a well known entertainment group contributes to the fact that Lin and her pals are head over heels in love with him. Miss Korea 2013 Kang Tae-yo made his acting debut on the small screen with the drama Miss Korea. Kang Tae-yo plays the role of the main character's son in the drama. The main character, Ma Eri, is portrayed by the seasoned actress Lee Mi Suk. This drama from 1997 portrays the story of a cosmetics company that is struggling to make ends meet while having a prominent presence in the industry. And these are just the sample dramas in which Kang Tae-yo starred in. I hope you like this list and if you know his other works, let us know by commenting below. We assure you that we will definitely watch them and give our thoughts about it. Give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more updates and trends. See you in the next video and don't forget to comment!